So how can you access and use iCloud on your Android phone and let's get into it. Now a lot of people might look up the Google Play Store and search for iCloud and even though you can find something in here like syncing services for iCloud mostly, well it doesn't really work the way that you would expect, right? And the reason for it is that obviously iCloud has been designed for Apple platforms. So on your Android, you cannot technically access it, but you will need to do it through a web browser. So you'll need to look up iCloud.com. You'll be able to, you know, use your email or phone number to sign in, give it a password and everything and get in a side. Keep in mind that a lot of accounts have two-factor authentication enabled, meaning that in order to sign in right here, you will be required to just give the uh, code which is sent to one of your Apple devices. So, you know, it is something that a lot of people need to know about it, but once you get inside, you will basically have access to the online version of iCloud. And uh, this includes seeing and browsing your iCloud photos and notes and the drive, like your storage file. So you can see it right there. I mean, it's okay. It works within a browser. So if that's enough for you, then I guess it's okay. But obviously it's never going to be as deeply integrated into an Android phone as it's part of the iPhone. So if you have never used iPhone before or don't plan on getting one, then I wouldn't really recommend you to explore iCloud, right? So it doesn't really make sense. There are better options like Google Drive or Microsoft OneDrive, Dropbox, so many different options, but iCloud is mainly designed for Apple devices. So even though you can access it right here, it's probably not the best idea to use it entirely or exclusively. So thanks a lot for watching. Let me know below in the comments if you ever use it, even on your Android device. Uh, subscribe for more guides and explanations like this one, and I'll see you later.